Gerard. Yeah. Thanks so, for I was telling these guys that I spoke to you before. Yeah. And wow, you're tall. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> How tall are you? I'm around six foot four. Um, you know, the shortest rice in the entire male, you know, male section of rice. Is, oh, really? Yeah, extended family, you know, I'm the runt. Okay, cool. Yeah. And are you from New York? I am originally from New York City. All right, yeah. and where are you living now? I'm uh, living in Croton on Hudson, which is a small town. Um, about 30 miles north of New York City, so in Westchester County. Okay, cool, cool, yeah. Mm -hmm. So uh, I was telling these guys on camera that mm -hmm. I, I, I spoke with you earlier, mm -hmm. and uh, you came up to me, and I was like, oh, yeah, I think you made a misplay here. And yeah. Like, yeah, I did, blah, blah, blah. But you had a really good attitude. You were like, yeah, everybody makes a mistake. You said yeah. Finkel makes a mistake with the uh, not blocking, and, yeah. you know, so what, what was your thought process through this tournament? I think, yeah, like, the, a lot of times, like, people get hung up on, like, a uh, mistake and they'll let it lead to more and more mistakes. The best thing is just to keep on trying to, like, play through it and just, you know, just play your, you know, just try and hope you get the right cards and hope you get make the right plays at the right time. Yeah, yeah, yeah I mean, and it's, really it. it's magic, so there's luck involved. Mm -hmm. And you, you can't really beat yourself up over, like, every single, er yeah. you know, play or, or yeah. whatever. Um, so what made you choose this deck? I've actually been playing for a while. Um, I usually been playing the local like, uh, legacy tournament, which is pretty big, um, and I've been playing there um, for a while. So I've been playing the, I've been playing that to some success, and just it really has a, I, in my opinion, has a really good solid matchup against like Maverick, Stoneblade, and like the Rug Delver, which I think are like the, the three most popular, popular decks. decks. Yeah, so yeah. like, I mean, as long as I don't run anything with like Tendrils of Agony or. You know, anything like, you know, bringing back Grizzle Brand or anything like that, I'm pretty good. Okay. So, yeah. Yeah, that's good. That's good. All right. So, uh, did you want to make any changes to your deck or do you think like anybody? Because, you know, next weekend there's another open and, mm -hmm. you know, eventually there's going to be the invitational June 15th, June 16th, which you're mm -hmm. probably going to go to now, right? Possibly, yeah. I mean, I got to look forward in the future. I, I work a lot right now. Okay. And so I don't, Magic's really like second place, like, yeah. as far as my life, but. I definitely would consider just playing and just competing again, which would be pretty sweet. Okay. Yeah. yeah probably, probably be a lot of fun, and, and now that it's a seventy-five thousand dollar prize pool, you know. So I'm sure a lot of people are going to take your deck, um, and you know, try it out for the Invitational or at least definitely the Opens in the next couple yeah. of weeks. So would you change anything, or should I just go to the Star City Games website and kind of copy I've been card less for card? I've been actually less and less le uh, happy with the one of Liliana, which. <laughs> oh really? <laughs> actually, I mean, she's really sweet. Like, she's good. Like in like certain like certain situations but like sometimes you just come up and just be like kind of a clunky draw yeah and like my hope was just to like i always found her boarding her out um i possibly maybe like another thing i was like thinking about was running four bolts like over like possibly explosives just to get like two for ones but like and your explosives is really like pretty good too so i, I, yeah. I it's really it, you can do a lot with the deck so it's not okay like, so it's not set in stone, but this is definitely yeah. a good, yeah. you know, yeah. base. And you know, if you want to make a few changes, it's fine. But mm -hmm. uh, they should probably start off by testing this version. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that's pretty good. Um, but yeah, so it's it, it was a long tournament. Mm -hmm. You know, and and you survived. You were the last uh, survivor of this yeah. tournament. You took it down. Uh, do you have any you know advice to uh, everybody at home before uh, you know we say goodbye? I don't just have fun. It's have most fun, important. Right? Yeah. It's really yeah. the most important thing in the whole world. And, and it's actually when when I when I watch you play or when I was talking to you, it's yeah. like it seems like you're just having fun. Yeah. Which is good. A lot of the other guys, and, and I mean even myself, lots of times I'll get like way too serious and I'll, yeah. I'll beat myself up and uh, I, I won't want to like eat. I'll be like I'm not eating until I win the next three rounds, you yeah. know. But you're just like whatever. <laughs> Let's have fun. Yeah. You know? And yeah. Uh, <laughs> and and that's a, I, I, I'm gonna take that uh, that advice mm. with me. Yeah. You know? So uh, yeah. I'll see uh, see if it pays off. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah. All right. So all right, man. I've well, had tons of fun. All right. Well, thank you. Thank you. You know, and uh, yeah, good luck. Long everything. track home, you know. What's up? Long track home to Westchester, New York. So. Yeah, it is. Yeah, <laughs> drive safe and everything.